Hey, what is up, guys? It's Dead Storm here, aka Phase Version 2. We'll get to that in a second. What I am bringing you here is a 24 and 1 domination gameplay here on Hardhat. Reason I'm calling myself Phase Version 2 is because I use the XM25 in this gameplay. And if you don't know, the XM25 absolutely stinks in anything besides hardcore. It's noob tubing also, so you know, you're gonna get a lot of slack, you're gonna get a lot of mouth and all that from everybody. But I've developed new terms, I've developed a new philosophy towards using the XM25. I am a quick tuber. That is right. You know how FaZe has all their hard scopers, quick scopers, trick shotters, all that? XM25, babies. Noob tubing at its grandest stage. Quick tubing, hard tubing, and no tubing. Phase version 2, join the cause. And I am totally corny. But anyways, guys, I'm psyched. It's a mail series. Let's answer some questions, right? All right. Our first question from a Kevin Sander1234. Hey, Dead Storm, love your vids, and I've been a sub for a while, and my question for you is, who would you like to be on YouTube, and who is your favorite YouTuber? My favorite YouTuber, honestly, I don't know. I, I mean, okay, if you want to talk about the YouTuber you would watch to be informed and and just for an overall professionally made video that's the top of its league it would be Woody's gamer tag but if you're looking for a video that's just funny can be white boy 7th street he has some very funny videos or it can be someone like minnesota burns it it depends to be honest with you i really don't have a favorite youtuber but if I really had to pick someone out of all of them to watch, it would probably be Woody's Gamer Tag just because of the professional ism. I don't even know if that's a word of his videos. And that's pretty much what I want to aspire to be, anyways, if that answers your question completely. I want to have the most professional videos now. I'm not going to be doing Black Ops 2 updates and all that. Honestly, I don't really like talking about Call of Duty much in my commentaries. Everybody does it. We're going to talk about different stuff. we got to be entertaining. we got to be unique. We've got to be different. That is what YouTube is asking everybody is there's got to be something different. You're not going to thrive. You're not going to make it big unless you are just totally good at talking about Call of Duty. Me, I could try, <laughs> but half of you would probably beat me in talking about Call of Duty, you know, with all that terminology and stuff. I'm just going to talk cool. And our next question from Crazy X Monkey 11 Did you plan to be a calm or out of nowhere you started making cool vids? Thank you for the compliment. I appreciate it, and I hope I'm making cool vids. That's my goal. That's what I aspire to do. I love all my vids. I'm full of myself. Whatever. Anyways, thanks for the compliment. To answer your question, out of nowhere, I did start making cool vids. I'm going to be honest. One day... I was like, I need to take a risk. I need to do something that I don't see everybody else do. And that is when I made the Nerd Rage at COD video. It ended up getting amazing praise. It, it was great. Uh, I got a lot of good feedback from that video. It's not HD. I was using Windows Live Movie Maker back in the day. <laughs> but what I'm saying is, if you guys are willing to do so, taking risks might pay off that's what i'm saying you can't have call of duty commentary after commentary if you want to do something like that you're gonna have to at least mix it up and put a different game in anyways to answer your question yeah i just started 
making vids and uh i never really thought of being a commentator i just wanted my videos to be on youtube so i could say hey i played that game of modern warfare 3 but look at me now right all right our next question from immortal resistance great vids dead storm keep them up my question is what is your favorite cod map of all time that is a tough question there are so many good maps and so many bad maps i'll have to say i hated that map uh in modern warfare 2 i think it was wasteland it was annoying it was so much open space i'm not a sniper that was asking you to get sniped or just be squashed by air support if someone noob tubed their way to a high kill streak not a good map on the other hand i i liked favela i liked um terminal and on black ops i liked nuketown uh modern warfare 3 i like it's kind of a tough question i never really thought of the maps i like on modern warfare 3 i do enjoy resistance is a good map i haven't played the new terminal but i'll probably like that one it's a really tough question man uh I can try and give you a better answer later. Anyways, <laughs> that is it for this week's mail series. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Submit your questions via PM or comments in the comment section below. I hope you guys have a great day as I will too. Peace, guys.